Aloha, and welcome to Madre Productions. My name is Scott Nordquist. Today's episode is entitled Words of Wisdom with Health Crusader Dr. Patricia Bragg. Thank you so much for joining us today, Dr. Bragg. It's a pleasure to have you here. Oh, thank you, Scott. I love Olelo, and I'm very pleased to be here. Oh, excellent, excellent. So let's begin right away. Why should we exercise? Well, my dear, you have 640 muscles. If you don't use them, you lose them. And it's very important that all people keep as active as possible because you need it to keep healthy and fit for a long, fulfilled life. Excellent, excellent. What is the proper, why is proper nutrition not talked about more often with our doctors? Well, unfortunately, uh, the medical profession didn't have a lot of nutrition courses in medical school. Mm. And we are finding that out. Dr. Shatani is our very good friend, and he is at the University of Hawaii Medical School. Of course. And he agrees with me what I say, that C. Everett Koop, the Surgeon General of the United States, retired, mm -hmm. said that my father, Paul Bragg, did more for the health of America than any one person he knew of. My father told the importance of good food, healthy food, organic food, without sprays and pesticides, mm. and no refined sugars and refined bread. Scott, we need healthy foods, healthy foods. Well, I know also as part of the, the Bragg Healthy Lifestyle, you promote fasting as a way towards health. Tell me a little about the fasting. We have our book here, The Miracle of Fasting, Proven Throughout History for Physical, Mental, and Spiritual Rejuvenation. Fasting is the greatest remedy the physician, from the, of the physician within, from Parcellus, the 15th century physician and father of body chemistry. Yes, fasting is the doctor within. You know, when a baby doesn't want to eat, you can put the food in his mouth, he'll spit it out. <laughs> and when an, your cat or your dog or an animal doesn't feel good, natural instinct, they'll fast. And your body workers, when you're fasting, they can clean up. Your body is self-healing and self-repairing. Each one of us are miracles. A miracle, yes, and definitely. And your body is a miracle. So how can a person begin to eat better? What, are the, what would be one of the first steps you would say to that journey? Oh, to be your own health captain, to realize with your fork, knife, and spoon, what you put in your mouth walks and talks tomorrow. It's simple as that. Huh. Food is fuel. And unfortunately, I, uh, people just eat, eat, don't think, and they've overfueled their body, and that's why we have obesity in America and around mm. the world. They've overfueled their body, and the body doesn't know what to do with it. Okay. Okay. So therefore, it stores it. So part of the other healthy lifestyle with the Bragg's family is apple cider vinegar. Tell me a little bit about your apple cider vinegar and why it's become such a miracle for so many people. Well, my dear, yes, a miracle. The father of medicine, Dr. Hippocrates, used in 400 BC to detox and cure and heal the body. Excellent. Yes, I yes. see from your apple cider vinegar book that you have here, The Miracle Health System, it's good for internal and external health tonic. Oh, it's a miracle. It's a, we have people who've gotten rid of their arthritis and their neuritis, got rid of their athlete's foot, their dandruff when you put it on your scalp like a half hour before you shampoo your hair, mm -hmm. and even put a little to brag vinegar. Guess what? In your hair rinse. And poo, uh, rinse, it gets all the gum off of your hair, shall we say, and makes your hair shine. Excellent. And I know that some celebrities and noted individuals in this day and age are active practitioners of your health system. So I, I know that Katy Perry is one of them. And we have a quote here from her mother, actually, Mary Hudson. It says, hello, Patricia. Here is the original green guitar you gave Katy in 1998. I found the pretty rock star pink feather pillow that you gave Katie, and she loves it. Katie and I thank you for paying for all of her singing lessons starting at the age of eight. That's right. That's when we right. had our church in Santa Barbara and Katie was singing that's right. in it. That's right. We do thank you, and Katie's voice thanks you big time as she is now a rock star as you predicted. Yes, yes. And I love guiding her and inspiring her to practice and get better, and she did. 
and she uses the <clears throat> our vinegar and guess what she's never missed a concert excellent well thank you so much for joining us today and sharing a bit of your wisdom about how to eat better and about the apple cider vinegar miracle. Well, I just love being with Olalo. Thank you. You're very welcome. And thank you all for inviting us into your homes this evening. We look forward to seeing you in our next episode.